Hi there, Cancer. Thank you for joining me for your weekly forecast for week commencing the 8th of August. As Venus, late last week, joined up with Mercury and also Jupiter in your sector of everyday communications, you have got an opportunity in the next few weeks to measure your point and the way you express it in a very careful and diplomatic way. But that could prove a little bit more challenging as this week begins because Venus is actually clashing in the first half of this week with Mars, the planet of drive, which is now in a more brittle part of your scope. Also, you have Saturn in, in this area, which is clashing with Mercury. And there could be a certain amount of tension around certain interactions. And one area that could be problematic, I feel, may be around money. Someone close to you may seek some kind of support from you at the middle of this week when there's a quarter moon. And they could pull at your heartstrings a little bit, and it may be actually hard to say no. But with Neptune still feeding into Saturn and also Mercury, the story you hear, well, it could be, let's say, a, a rather more edited version of the reality. So I would proceed with a degree of caution. After all, if you keep showing uh, a very protective streak towards this individual, they may never learn to manage their resources much more on their own two feet. So you may find with the force of Saturn and the drive of Mars that you could actually say no, and they might not like it. And even if you try to be very diplomatic about it, your point may not be appreciated. Well, it could just be one of those situations where you have to stand firm for what you believe. You could decide to splash some money yourself this week, and it may be on something that's to do with a digital device or some kind of labour-saving uh, uh, piece of equipment which makes life that little bit more easy for you, especially on the domestic front. The great news is that Saturn does end its five and a half months backward journey as this week draws to a close. It's been in your sector of health, work and fitness and its recent right angle to Neptune certainly hasn't been a help. And if you have been feeling rather drained and it seems that your need to have some freedom and space from those everyday obligations has been rather limited and cramped, well, I think Saturn starting to go forward is certainly a step in the right direction. But this is a week when, with the sun continuing in the part of your horoscope that is to do with your values and also to do with money, then that's an area that you can try to think about, but just be conscious of the blurriness that comes from the right angle between Venus and Mars and the T-square between Mercury, Neptune and Saturn. It's been a real pleasure being with you. Thank you for joining me. Good luck and goodbye for now.